create the world's strongest magician. A man starts with all negative attributes. Because every additional negative attribute, he will be able to obtain an additional characteristic. However, because there are too many negative attributes, as a result, the character he created was unusually thin. Originally, men didn't care too much. But in the next second, a strong attraction comes. The man lost consciousness on the spot. Wait until he wakes up again. What greeted him was an angry fist. Only then did he realize. He became the character he created. At the same time, the factory director ordered everyone. Hurry to the assembly room and get to work. And he never thought of it. I'm actually trapped in this body. The screen changes. The man has spent three days and three nights in this place. Every day the sun rises and the sun sets and then rest. Eating scraps all day. Even though he does a perfect job every time. But the factory director didn't dare to do anything to him. Because men often look sick. Just seeing this look. They all feel very unlucky. But. How to stay awake in such a bad situation. This is all thanks to the man's spiritual attributes. Although in this world. He suffered from various negative states. But it also means. He could have the same magical talent. And as long as you can show your talent. He can escape from here. To do this, he must first observe the terrain here. At this time he noticed someone talking outside. They are worried. Can we exchange fire with the union on time the day after tomorrow? And what they produced was taken away by the unions. Sold to black magician. He's actually a black magician. It seems that magic can indeed be used here. At the same time. The uncle took out a potion from his arms. This is the latest product. It can reduce toxicity to the body. This potion is full of magic. At this time, the man noticed the magic flowing in the potion. And reacted to it. In an instant, magic energy filled the whole body. This is the sixth sense beyond the five senses. Only to see another man suddenly appear in front of her. Only then did she react. The magic power is always flowing in my body. The swimming magic enters the body along with the breath. This is a feeling that is both strange and familiar to men. This is the power of light. World of magic. The screen changes. The man is studying the magic power in his hands. Maybe you can escape from this place with just this magic power. And the delivery time is two days later. This is the best time for him to escape. But how should he avoid the factory director's sight? At this time. He suddenly remembered that there was a method that could brighten the skin. This looks like having a fever to others. At the same time. The factory director praises the uncle for his hard work. So he gave him a potion. And asked him to get rid of the man. If the union sees him like that. Will cause unnecessary trouble. Then the uncle agreed. The screen changes. The day of delivery has come. When everyone is ready to work. Only the man fell ill in bed. Just when he thought his plan was about to be implemented. The appearance of the uncle changed everything. I thought the uncle would take this opportunity to deal with him. But he took out a bottle of potion and handed it to the man. Although this is a cheap potion. But it's no problem to use it for walking. A moment later. Man was very surprised by this potion. Active medicine can actually do this to such an extent. And he was very curious. The reason why the uncle did this. Looks like the escape plan is about to change. At the same time. Goods are being handed over at the site. The union members could tell at a glance that the quantity of goods was wrong. So Dang even accused them of not doing things well without the help of the union. Then this factory has long since ceased to exist. At this time, the man took advantage of being the factory manager to run errands. He motioned to the bald man to open the factory director's office for him. So the bald head reluctantly took out the key. 
and motioned the man to follow him. And the moment the door is opened, the man has already stored his magic power. I saw a lightning strike directly hit the bald head. He was beaten on the spot until he was foaming at the mouth, falling to the ground unconscious. Then the man picked up the key. It seems like this is the car key. Immediately afterwards, he started rummaging through boxes and cabinets in the room. A moment later, not only did he find a box of potions, I even got a light gun. And just when he wanted to absorb the potion, there was movement outside the door. It turns out someone smelled the potion. So I wanted to open the door and find out. What I didn't expect was. What caught my eyes was this scene. Just when he was stunned. Nanyuan has already launched an attack on it. But he dodged it sideways. It's magic. Who are you? At this time, the man's magic power has been exhausted. At the same time, he also discovered the man's identity. Just when he wanted to attack him. I saw the man took out his light gun and pointed it at him. And in order to save one's life. So she promised the man. He can keep this matter secret. And that door leads to the underground parking lot. Men can get out from here. But the man obviously doesn't believe his promise. After a moment of confusion. The man still chose to shoot. At the same time. Officers coming to patrol. Discovered this harmful scene. The man had already driven to the exit. Facing the uncle's inquiry. The man just moved silently. Used the light gun to signal the uncle to open the door for him. At this time, the guardrail is slowly being lined up. The uncle prayed that the man would let him go. But if you let him live, then he will definitely become a trouble for men. Accompanied by a gunshot. The man passed the last hurdle. In such extreme circumstances, he can still remain absolutely calm. This must be the unique talent of magicians. The screen changes. The man drove to the city. And the background here. Completely different from the previous version of World 2.0. Everything here is full of magic elements. This also means. Magic for the civilization of this world. Has made a huge contribution. At this time, the man. Suffering from negative attributes. So he decided to find a place to rest for a while. A moment later. The man came to a hotel. After a short rest. He finally recovered. But the cost of a day. Let men who are not already wealthy become even more embarrassed. So in order to survive. He must try his best. But he has no identity in this world. Therefore, he cannot obtain remuneration through formal channels. So he decided to punish evil and promote good. And then plunder their wealth. That way, it won't cause too much trouble for men either. Then he entered a meditative state. Concentrate all the magic power on your ears. A moment. All the sounds around him reached his ears. A moment later. He locked their position. And at this time. The negative attributes of the body strike again. So the man decisively inhaled a bottle of medicine. It's his turn to perform next. At the same time, two gangsters are bullying an honest man. Because he lost their stuff. Then they planned to sell his parts. To compensate for losses. And just then, the man's appearance rescued him in time. The gangsters were stunned on the spot. Then the men took away all their belongings. Then he asked him. Is there no need for identity here? A place where you can work. And in order to repay the man for saving his life. So he told the man a place. Although it looks like a bar. But that might just be a disguise. Therefore, men will not expose themselves prematurely. With the influx of magic. The man's face changed instantly. Because in this world. He only believes in himself. A moment later. The man asked Kubo straight to the point. Are there jobs for magicians here? And at this time. I saw the bar owner coming towards me. Magicians are very rare beings. 
Then she introduced herself to the man as Jenny. And for safety reasons. So the man didn't tell him his name. Immediately afterwards. They talked about the work related to magicians. If you only learned a little bit about it. You dare to call yourself a magician. Then he wouldn't find this very interesting. And he was very curious about what type of magic the man had. At the same time. I saw the magic power condensed in the man's hand. The next second, a fierce lightning force appeared in his hand. Is it actually lightning? This is a very rare attribute. So he immediately recommended a job to the man. It's a bounty hunter job. You can get paid easily. Because the result can be determined quickly. Targeted by Tyler Evans. He was three days ago. Trying to snatch Achilles safety equipment. Looks like he failed. A lowly scavenger. It is impossible to break through Achilles defense line. Other scavengers involved were dealt with on the spot. He is the only one left. Achilles then handed over the cleaning work to. We and the team behind that guy quit. So there won't be any problems. So he took over the task. Because this task can get 3 million games. Then the man asked for the guy's blood sample. He now. Just use an ordinary magic. In memory. Although I saw it in the world version 2.0. But there are several types of magic that have been sorted out. And the most suitable magic right now is a bloody chase. Then a burst of red energy enveloped it. Then a huge spiritual snake was generated from magic. The screen changes. Man follows the spirit snake. Came to an abandoned subway station. I saw the spirit snake that found the target. Instantly turned into a ball of smoke. Finally found you. Tyler Evans. At this time, Taylor looked panicked. Because she doesn't know at all. How did the man find her? In order to cope with this battle. The man is even fully prepared. Unexpectedly, he ran away in a hurry. No way. Men have to use this. A magic that I haven't quite mastered yet. A moment. A powerful energy hit Taylor directly. The pain was so painful that he was dying. So why choose to escape? And at this time. I saw a huge blow coming. It's actually a giant attack horse. Fortunately, the man set up defenses in advance. Otherwise the consequences will be disastrous. Then he strengthened his defenses. Now he is not even afraid of cannons. Then use magic to detect the surroundings. But it seems that the enemy is not around him. There are two reasons why it cannot be detected. One is that the enemy is one kilometer away. The other is to use magic perception. Hide your location. But soon he realized something was wrong. Because that attack was not aimed at his enemy. The target is Taro. Could it be that the person behind him wants to get rid of him? But this will not hinder the man's mission. At the same time, he will not let go of the enemy. Because he wants them to know. Hunter Madara is a ruthless person. At the same time. The man noticed the slight fluctuation of the enemy's magic power. The next second he discovered the specific location of the enemy. The moment he killed Taylor. At this time, the enemy has not realized that he has exploded. I saw the man slowly raising his left hand. In an instant. A bolt of lightning power gathered in his hand. This is the representative magic in the lightning system. Then there were countless thunders in the sky. As the man waved his left hand, calling for thunder and lightning. Then a fierce lightning flash. Rush towards the enemy head on. Just hear a loud noise. The building was destroyed instantly. I didn't expect the power of this magic to be so outrageous. Now man. You can confidently call yourself a lightning magician now. Then the man came to the building. But no trace of the enemy was found. Although the man was a little surprised by this. But his purpose has been achieved.
Because from today on, a lightning magician is born. A moment later, man returns to hotel to collect bounty. But Jenny on the side was very curious. Because bounties like this. Find people. It takes more time than completing the task. How on earth did he achieve this in such a short period of time? Mission accomplished. However, the man said it was all luck. It's hard to delve deeper into this controversy. At the same time, the man wants to take on the next assignment. But he was rejected. Because he doesn't quite trust men yet. So he said the next sentence, I will come again. Then he turned and left. At this time, Grandpa used Stubiner's network too. Found the man who just fought. Unexpected picture. This guy is so ridiculously strong. The screen changes. In order to master the magic system of this world. So the man came to the city library to find out. At the same time, he must also find ways to extend his life. Because of the influence of negative attributes. As a result, his life is constantly being lost. After a careful search. Man is attracted by an article. That's the magic pattern. Each magician has his own unique magic mode. And great magicians above level 8. You can even modify it. So the man follows the steps. The next second only a blue light appeared. It seems that this is the magic pattern of men. But how strong are magicians above level 8? So the man tried to release some magic. In an instant, the pattern in my hand changed. It seems that with the outflow of magic power, the magic model is also changing. Although I don't know how strong the level 8 magician is. But he definitely has talent in this area. But he looked through all the books in the library. But I couldn't find any records about ordinary magic. Magic can be divided into two categories, unique and ordinary. Unique magic. Every magician can only master one series of magic. It is more powerful and professional than ordinary magic. Although ordinary magic is not powerful enough, but its scope of application is quite wide. At least in world 2.0. But in this world. But I can't find any records about ordinary magic. Even though he has great magical talent. To no avail. And now. Not only did he not find a unique magic about the world. It even caused a lot of problems. At the same time. If you want to be a magician. He saw a blonde girl walking towards him. It's better to give up. Because. That's not something that can be mastered by just relying on books. You must go to school to study. But entering the school requires a certain foundation. Only by your own ability. It's impossible to do this. Because. This is a field that requires a lot of luck and talent. But men don't agree so much. Because he believes that it is better to give up too early than to give up too early. He is willing to try it. Even the girl didn't think of it. He would refute himself like this. So I handed him a business card. And said that if magic is needed. Just come to yourself. I saw it clearly written above. His identity is a professor at the magic academy. But the man only thinks he is a strange woman. A moment later. Man comes to the vegetable market. He wants to buy some vegetables to replenish his body. But at this time, I encountered an identity check. But luckily it didn't happen to him. So he walked forward with anxiety. But at this moment. A short haired girl stopped him. I saw him questioning the man calmly. Did you do something wrong? Why does your magic pattern look like this? And the magic pattern. It is an important way for them to check their identity. At the same time. Girl, visit again. Why are you here? The man said he was here to buy groceries. Then I bought some vegetables in the store. But just at checkout. I saw a voice coming. Your magic is unique. 
and he obviously didn't realize what was happening. Why is a magician like you here? I don't know what you are talking about. You just came to this city recently, right? Otherwise I wouldn't be able to remember your magic pattern clearly. Who is this woman? Why do you know all the details about yourself? Accompanying the vegetables handed by the woman. They ended their conversation. Could it be that he passed the barrier magic on me? Did you know the magic pattern? It seems that this guy is no ordinary person. You should pay more attention to the use of magic in the future. The screen changes. The man at this time was listing various magic spells. This is what he is known for in World 2.0. But he couldn't get out of these magics. Find clues about unique magic. Even his health shows no signs of improvement. And in order to survive, he must acquire an identity and substantial assets. So he found his boss Jenny again. And told him that he needed an identity. And he replied that it was very simple. That is a little expensive. Need 20 million sir. But Jenny told him not to worry. Because he has already arranged a job for the man. This work was commissioned by the company. So the rewards you get will be relatively high. So the man decided to accept the commission. Then they changed places to talk in detail. This time the client is Barrett's Corporation. And they provided two conditions for us to choose from. The first option is to leave no stone unturned. Get all data about Charlotte Cosmetics. The second article is. Destroy all data in the factory. The first option is obviously unattainable. So. Their commission this time is to destroy this factory. After thinking for a moment. The man decided to accept the commission. But in the next second. Jenny introduced the partners who participated in the operation. Only a dead pool appeared in front of them. And greeted him friendly. He is the foreign aide of Antares office. Called Dylan Akasi. Then they exchanged their names amicably. But the man is very curious why he has a partner this time. Because Jen and I felt that this mission was only. It cannot be completed by one person. This time the commission is divided into. Jenny Jen will no longer charge handling fees. This can be regarded as a remedy for making mistakes. Does she want to test the bottom line of men? At the same time. Jenny motioned for them to take a look at the design drawings of the factory. The screen changes. They came to area 42 where the factory is located. And Jenny has a high opinion of men. Because. He's not someone who gives up fees easily. It seems that she wants to protect her relationship with men. I didn't expect that underneath such an exaggerated appearance. You can actually see everything at a glance. At the same time. Dylan handed the man a business card. And said that if you want to find a job. You can contact him. Is this trying to trick me? After all. It doesn't hurt to have an extra magician friend. Then you have to see how efficient you are at doing things. A moment later. They came to the factory. And the security here doesn't look too strict. Because. No one wants to mess with a big business like Charlotte. If it weren't for Barris's commission. Dylan would never have come here. But these security personnel they hired. They're all guys with criminal records. So even if he killed them accidentally. My own conscience will not be condemned. So after a meal and getting ready. They started taking action. The operation was initiated by Dylan from the back door. Attract their attention. Then the man was responsible for sneaking into the warehouse. Blow up the entire factory. After assigning their respective tasks. I saw Dylan go out in a blink of an eye. The security personnel in front of me haven't reacted yet. Dylan pushed him to the ground. Then a bolt of lightning flashed across. Dylan is behind the enemy. Then an elbow strike. Knocked him out on the spot. At the same time. Dylan gestured to the man that it was okay. Moved. And the enemy on the side wants to secretly call for support. 
but Dylan stopped him on the spot. Next it's the man's turn to act. I saw him after absorbing a bottle of medicine. Then slowly walked towards the warehouse. Facing the locked door. The man immediately used a cutting machine to open it. But what caught his eye was an old man with a panicked face. He's actually an ordinary security guard. So the man decisively used natural hypnosis. Then I saw the old man slowly falling asleep. And in order not to harm civilians in this operation. So the man used a puppet on it. Then he controlled him and walked out of the factory. At the same time. There was a fierce fight ahead. It seems that Dylan is keeping them in check very well. There shouldn't be any problems now, right? And just now. The enemy moves with lightning speed. Just clean up the enemies. I didn't expect there were more flies here than I thought. Then he went straight to the factory. Unexpectedly, he was already surrounded by enemies. Fair enough. Because it saves him the time to find enemies. The words haven't finished yet. I saw a red lightning flash across. Kill all the enemies in an instant. Facing the siege of enemy groups. He didn't panic at all. After a moment of fighting. I saw him confidently shouting, who else is there? At the same time. The man came inside the warehouse. And this kind of large warehouse. Just need to find the heating and cooling pipe facilities. Because the gas inside is enough to blow up the entire factory. After some rotation. Man finally opens pipe and releases gas. Now all you need to do is light the fire. He raised his hand and created sparks. And next. All he has to do is set up the magic. Start after they leave. So he raised his hand. A timer is added to the spark magic. All thanks to. The girl in the vegetable shop let the man know. Magic can be used in conjunction with each other. Set the fixed car to 5 minutes later. Now they just need to escape from here. And at this time. There was movement outside the door. I saw a huge hole in the huge iron door. At this time, Dylan didn't realize what was happening. Then the door actually flew towards him. Could it be? I saw a strong crocodile boss. Suddenly appeared in front of him. At this time, the man was rushing to the scene. Then he started observing from behind the door. Is it actually a crocodile? At the same time. The two of them chatted with each other. Crocodile and Jenny must be old acquaintances. It can be learned from their conversation. Crocodiles were paid 1 billion to protect this place. And for Jenny's sake. He said he could make Dylan die more comfortably. Maybe it's not that easy. Subsequently. Signaling the crocodile boss to throw the bag of weapons to him. Crocodiles are very disdainful of this. Because in his eyes. These things are just like toys. Is it a toy? You'll know if you try it. The words haven't finished yet. I saw Dylan being punched against the wall. Looks like today is not the day to use a spear. Then he launched multiple attacks on the crocodile. But without exception, he was blasted against the wall. Even men didn't think of it. He will be so rampant. Now there are only two minutes left in the spark timing. They must get out of here as soon as possible. And Dylan. How could I have been stuck with this kind of monster for so long? At the same time. The crocodile immediately mocked Dylan. Those murderous eyes back then. Now they have all disappeared without a trace. Don't tell me, you seem to be getting stronger and stronger. Then Dylan took out two long knives from his back. The next second his eyes suddenly became sharp. Do you feel the murderous aura now? Then they launched an attack on him. But he raised his hand to resist. Then I saw a figure passing by. The enemy has arrived behind the crocodile. The crocodile waved its tail to repel it. Dylan at this time. I also realized that time is running out. So. 
Then he launched a very fierce attack on the crocodile. But he easily resisted them all. At the same time, I saw the crocodile punching me hard. But was restrained on the spot by a bolt of lightning. Only then did Dylan realize that the man had helped him. But this is the only time. A chance to defeat the crocodile boss. Faced with such a fierce attack by the crocodile, Devin jumped into the air. Then he waved the two swords in his hands. I'm going to chop him down. But at this moment, I saw the crocodile throwing out its tail. Knocked him to the ground on the spot. Then he grabbed his neck. I didn't expect you to have helpers. Then I saw the crocodile's legs suddenly exerting force. Then he punched Dylan hard in the face. He knocked it back dozens of meters on the spot. Next he will have to deal with the man hiding in the dark. But what he didn't expect was. The man had already sneaked outside the factory. After being struck by such a powerful lightning. The body is actually intact. This is simply not a monster they can handle. And judging from the direction where Dylan was shot away just now. He should be lying around here. Then the man discovered Dylan. After confirming that he is still alive. All that's left is to take him and escape from here. So men added muscles to themselves. And speed enhancing magic. Although he has the negative attribute of being poisoned by magic power. Try to avoid injecting magic into the body. But there is no other way now. Nowadays they should stay as far away from factories as possible. At the same time. Crocodile turns over a bucket inside the factory. But no one was seen for a long time. But at this time, he felt something was wrong. On the other side, the countdown ends. A fierce flame. Swallowed the entire factory in an instant. In an instant. The factory was reduced to ashes. The two of them were unscathed by the defensive magic. At the same time. Polyester, which had been hit hard before, slowly recovered. Then I saw the man replenishing a bottle of potion. Is this actually an active potion? I heard this thing has serious side effects. But compared to this. Men are more concerned about whether their commission has been completed. And Dylan. He can actually fight on PAR with that kind of monster. It seems he is also a monster. At this time. Dylan is urging the man to get out of here quickly. Do you think? Would he be able to survive in that situation? Apparently the man doesn't know the crocodile's background. So Dylan introduced him to the origin of crocodiles. He plays for Crokinackle. That guy is a mercenary. When he retired from mercenary service. I have been working as a minister in Cloken. Crokin has always been known for its high risk. He can be a minister. Definitely very powerful. At the same time. I saw the crocodile slowly standing up from the fire. Damn guy. I will never let you go. At this time, he was already furious. I saw him instantly look like he was sprinting. Dylan looked panicked when he saw this. Then he signaled the man to escape from here as soon as possible. But I thought it was too late. I saw the crocodile ejected. In an instant, I caught up with the two people who were fleeing. Then he was forced to stop. Then he slapped his hands on the ground to act as a buffer. Although this is a magic use. A world that strengthens the body. But this is too heavy a burden for men. At the same time. The crocodile has discovered the identity of the man's magician. But as a magician. The man looks extremely young. At this time, the man could tell the current situation at a glance. It's currently impossible to escape from here with Dylan. And Dylan is now playing dead. So the man had to fight the crocodile. But he must end the fight as soon as possible. Because the longer the battle drags on, the lower his probability of winning will be. Next he will challenge this monster alone. So. Are you the boy who unleashed the lightning magic? Has no one ever taught you? Can't you interrupt other people's fights? But you are not human. Then I saw the crocodile laughing. 
You're such an interesting guy. If you didn't destroy the factory, I might let you live. But it's impossible now. I saw the crocodile suddenly slapped him with its palm. But the man's eyes widened. Gravity bound. In an instant, countless black energy entangled it. Stopped the crocodile's attack on the spot. And he hasn't reacted yet. Several more restraints came. Trapped it in an instant. The more serious the target. Targets will be more restricted. Crocodiles are very disdainful of this. I saw him exerting a little strength. Break free from the shackles on the spot. So the man added a few more constraints to it. And incidentally blocked his mouth. And next he wants to use all the magic power in his body. Deliver a fatal blow. But at this moment. Just heard a roar. The crocodile broke free from all restraints on the spot. Damn, what kind of amazing power is this? It's my turn to attack next, right? And at this time. The man has already gathered his magic power. In this moment of crisis. This will be his last magic. With the cold wind blowing. At this time, the crocodile did not realize what was going to happen. I saw that the man had gathered his magic power. Then he rode violently toward the ground. At the same time. The crocodile also attacked him. The moment I come into contact with magic. The crocodile was frozen into a huge ice block. This is the frozen soul. Looking at the crocodile frozen into ice. At this moment, the man finally felt a lot more relaxed. On the side, Dylan was complaining about the cold weather. And reminded the man to take this opportunity to escape from here quickly. Men also agree with this. But at this moment. I heard the sound of ice breaking behind me. Is it too late? Damn it. We have to subdue him before he comes out. But the man's remaining magic power can't do anything. And he seemed to have thought of something. I saw him take out a light gun from behind. How to use small magic power to assist weapons. This is world 2.0. When a man is a marksman. Frequently used shooting combination magic. Then the man added a bunch of rods to the light gun. And this light gun cannot fully withstand these hardships. So this will be the man's final blow. With the ice cubes falling. The man slowly pulled the trigger. Accompanied by a gunshot. I saw the crocodile was knocked away on the spot. Did not think of. A man's last resort would be like this. But will it work this time? At this time, the man has exhausted all his energy. I saw the crocodile rising slowly from the mist. This is really a good attempt. It's a pity that your opponent is me. I didn't expect the design to be superimposed with a lot of magic. He actually knocked it down easily with just his eyelids. He's a real monster. The crocodile burst into laughter upon hearing this. I never said I wasn't a monster. But. That kind of attack still made him feel a little pain. And polyester on the side was already scared. Shivering. Even men can't do anything about it. Because he no longer has any magic power. Then I saw two people taking out knives. At this moment, they can only bite the bullet and go on. At the same time. I saw the crocodile clenching its fist tightly. Then he jumped into the air. Then throw out a punch. Punch at them. Are you going to die here? Accompanied by a loud noise. I saw that the man's defense was instantly shattered. At this moment, he was surprised as to why he was still alive. But bursts of green light came in front of me. Who are you? This made the crocodile realize that time had taken too long. Because in front of it is the guardian of the country. Evelyn Croak and Ashley's. You went too far this time. Then the crocodile was knocked back with one blow. You thought you destroyed the whole factory. Can you still escape intact? 
but the crocodile looked confused. It turned out that Evelyn had him. Believed to be the culprit of this incident. Originally he wanted to explain something. But he didn't believe the crocodile's words at all. Always identify him as the culprit. So the crocodile decided not to waste any more time. And choose to turn around and leave. Because of fighting Evelyn. It's not part of his mission. And he never does anything thankless. Did not expect. This monster is actually afraid of fighting Evelyn. That means. Evelyn has the same strength as him. At the same time. The two expressed their gratitude to him. Only then did the man realize. Evelyn in front of me. She turned out to be the girl I saw at the vegetable market that day. Subsequently. Evelyn suddenly realized where she had seen the man. However, the man said he had no knowledge of this. Then he said he admitted the wrong person. Because the magic patterns are different. This is because every time a man uses magic. His magic pattern will change accordingly. A moment later. Evelyn gives a man a piece of advice. Try not to mess with Croc. If you want to live a stable life. Then he turned and left. And at this time. The two discussed the issue of layering. Because Dylan didn't leave the factory early enough. This series of things happened. So men must get more rewards. So Dylan readily agreed. He only needs to take away 10 million yuan. The remaining 40 million bounty is all reserved for men. The screen changes. The man at this moment has been bedridden for a week. Although it is not clear. Is this because of absorbing too much medicine? The resulting situation. But he realized he couldn't go on like this anymore. He must rely on strong willpower to survive this period. At the same time, he needs to find better medicines for himself. And he should get paid. A moment later. The man found Jenny. What a pity. If you die. I'll be able to keep this bounty all to myself. Then he handed the reward to the man. Counting the bonus given by Barry. Here is a total of 60 million. Plug. But I heard you were almost killed by a crocodile, right? If no one comes to intervene later. The man is probably dead. Speaking of this matter. I wonder if Jenny has heard of the name Evelyn. But Jenny didn't know much about it. I only know that he is a person who works for the country. So what about Kroken, to which the crocodile belongs? He only knows. Kroken is a very dangerous entity. Wherever they go there's no grass growing. Could it be? Is this why Dylan is so calm all the time? It seems like he's used to this kind of thing. At the same time. Jenny handed a note to the man. Follow the address above. You can get an identity. But men are still. He needs Jen and I to do him another favor. A moment later. The man followed the address on the note and arrived at his destination. At this time, the bald head was curiously asking who the man was. Hello, I was introduced here by Jenny.